Sometimes you feel like a shame or like a ruse. A half cooked idea or a trick to be used. And sometimes you feel so lowly, halted, and stark. Waving in the wind like a flag that's torn apart. But we all walk blindly when we stagger and we strut. And we're all dealt the hands with the cards of our luck. And we all bow down silent at the words when we're struck by the shameless light of the broken afternoon. Ready to do Pearson Eisenhower? Climb all the presidents? <laughs> Yay, New Hampshire. Well, I already hit my first roadblock. You have to pay $3 for parking here. So, note that. If you're going to the Crawford Path, three bucks. Three bucks for parking. So I'm burning a path from this little pay station in my car. It's like my second walk back. There's little payment envelopes. Figures in the woods, they don't have anything like a bill slot machine where you can just put it in. And... Oh well. Let's just kill more trees, right? Let's see. This... That's the envelopes. So you take one of those. Someone clearly stole all the pencils. Alright. Fees oh. waved. We're a little late, or yeah. early for that. I would, I would say that you're you're right on cue with this large green pole. <laughs> Sarah doesn't want me to take pictures of her. Pictures are okay. Pictures are okay, but video. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but this is yeah pretty simple. As long as you have a picture of it. So it's like yay, and then there's Pierce. Yep, and then. And then there's Eisenhower, and then we're gonna go back down the Edmonds path, and then down, down that road right. until we get to gotcha. back to where we are. Huh. Ooh, man, okay. Let's go! Crawford connector, let's go. Sarah's not feeling very photogenic today. What? Alrighty then. Mount 302 is that way, and we're going this way. Alrighty. All that mapless hiking I plan on doing. Oh, well, we're gonna take a little detour to Gibbs Falls. See how nice this looks. Tell you what. I've only been at it for about half a mile, but white mountains don't waste any time going straight up. Not like one of those Adirondack hikes where you're walking in for three miles and, and then you start ascending. There's no warm up here, you just go. This waterfall actually looks pretty cool. She's looking the other way, ignoring me. <laughs> yeah, it's been a tough hike so far. No hike in, just go straight up. I am tired. Ah, oh, boy. So you're gonna keep following the Crawford path. Don't go the other way to the huts. You wanna go this way. Follow Sarah. <laughs> I'm gonna make you shake your head all day. So we're just sitting down to take a little break. It's uh, gotta be getting pretty close, probably within a mile, but it's been 
pretty consistently right uphill the uh, whole way so get up and get going and probably not stop till we get there Bunch of people on the sun. <laughs> it is gorgeous up here. Oh, well, we just got off the summit. This is just below it, but this is one hell of a view. We've got Eisenhower and Washington right in front of us, and all the other presidentials. Well, we're gonna go to Eisenhower next. So we just got off of Pierce and we're gonna keep going down this trail until we get to Eisenhower. And it looks like most of this is gonna kind of be above the tree line. This should be really, really cool. Really scenic. Ugh. Oh, hey Eisenhower. Looking steep. Yeah, we just came from Pierce over there. And uh, I mean, most of this has been above tree line, so we've been able to kind of see our progress the whole way. So we're almost there. Just got this really steep hill in front of us that we, we got to do. So almost done well that was quick what? three and a half hours oh. to the two mountains thanks to yours truly leading the way yeah there's Sarah all obsessed with herself oh. I, can, I can see like I don't know if those are cars or if that's like the train just trudging up Mount Washington, but look how slow those are going. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, 5.2 miles to go. And we're done. Yay, hiking. Stop. <laughs> the area ahead has the worst weather in America. Many have died there from exposure and even in the summer. Turn back now if the weather is bad. <laughs> Alrighty then. We're going down though, so. Yeah. <laughs> and we're back on the road. We just pretty much jogged the 2.9 miles on Edmonds Path, and now we're just walking down this road until we. Oh my God! How does not? How does? How many cars have bottomed out on that? I don't know, but uh, anyway, we're just getting back to the other trailhead, which is 2.3 miles, and then it's food time. Looking a little sweaty, Sarah. So well, that's it. We're back at the parking lot, um, back at my car, and uh, we absolutely crushed that hike just under, I want to say just under six hours. So uh, it's time to get out of here. We'll find a spot to eat, and that's two more off the Northeast 111 list, so Eisenhower and Pierce are donezo. I'm just going to wait for Sarah to get back, and we're going to get out of here. Okay, so now for my review of the Pearson Eisenhower Loop Hike that we uh, 
we got to do there. Really easy hike as far as I'm concerned. It was just a very straightforward loop hike. You know, we didn't even bring a map with us. Very easy to follow the trails. Um, and given the fact that there was a very high volume of hikers out there on the weekend, you know, it just kind of went to show that it is suitable for really anybody. You really kind of get the, you know, the view for all the effort that you have to put into this one. Um, a lot of the book times I was looking at saying this hike takes eight hours plus. I don't believe it. I think it's more more on the lines of like five and a half to six and a half hours. As long as you keep going and you're in shape. Um, the initial ascent to Pierce um, going up the Crawford Path was a little bit steep. Um, didn't really relent at any point, but at the same time, you just you gain all that elevation really quickly. And uh, we were done with that within about an hour and a half. So um, from there, you know, the hike over to Eisenhower initially really simple. You just kind of you know it was a very slight descent, and then all of a sudden, you know, you hit this big wall of earth that's Eisenhower naked to the summit and um, you know the, the views you get up there are really great so um, going back down the Edmonds path it was a little rocky but needless to say Sarah and I we really just flew down that and then now uh, you just make a little uh, walk down the road there for another uh, 2.3 miles till you get back to your trailhead and uh, that's the whole hike so um, overall I give the views for both of them. Pierce, I'll give them an 8. Eisenhower, I give it a 9. And then uh, as far as difficulty goes, we'll give it a 4 uh, for both. Just not much, not much difficulty on that.